She's incredible. If there's one nice thing I can say about Cerberus, it's that they know how to build a ship. And about that, Cerberus, I mean. I owe you an apology. How so? Back when you got this ship, Dr. Chalk was contacting me, asking me to help with your mission against the Collectors. I refused. I didn't have your back, and I'm sorry for that. Your alliance first. That's the way it should be. Thank you, Commander. Glad to be aboard. Carry on, Adams. Aye, aye, sir. Can't be. No. I guess that's right. Hey, Tally. How's it going? Oh, sorry. I didn't hear you. I just got communication from the fleet. Sorry. From Rannoch. In the old days, I'd send any new technology I found back to the fleet. I should probably be doing that with the agriculture samples now. I, I don't know anything about raising crops. How are your people doing? It's crazy. The Geth are... helping. Setting up housing, adapting power systems. They are doing in weeks what would have taken us years. Geth are even uploading into the suits of Quarian volunteers. They're rewriting environmental functions, jump-starting our immune systems. So the Quarians won't have to wear those suits anymore? It doesn't seem possible, but... Yes, in a few years, with Geth improvements, we won't need them. We might still wear them. The suits have become part of our society. But a rupture won't be a death sentence. Today, on Rannoch, there are Quarian children who will grow up healthy and strong. Thanks to the Geth. They owe that to you. No. I'd have killed the Geth with no regrets. And I'd have been wrong. Thank you. Anytime. Just let me know if you let a Geth upload itself in there. <laughs> no. The only person who gets inside my suit is you. Nothing stands between us now. Whatever the galaxy throws at us, I'll be at your side. Either way... I left something for you up in your cabin. Go have a look. Trainer, can you send up Diana Allers? She wants to talk to me. She's on her way, Commander. I'm sure you've got a million questions. I narrowed it down to 40. Let's see how you do with the top 10. Commander, the last time most of us heard about Geth, they were attacking the Citadel alongside Sovereign. Yes, and you should know that was a minority of the Geth. Most of them are not hostile to organics. Is that how you explain that they're allies, and no longer dangerous robots who stick humans on spikes? What you have to realize is that despite their reputation, most Geth are not inherently violent. The Quarians attacked them. The Geth fought back in self-defense just like any organic would. Now that we've freed the Geth from Reaper control, they'll want payback for their enslavement. But you're going to take an army of synthetics to fight Reapers with untold hacking abilities. What's keeping the Reapers from reprogramming the Geth like they have before? The Geth are extremely intelligent, and they put incredible thought into solving this problem. They're not gonna turn again. I bet my life on it. Now here's a question from a Batarian on Omega. Commander Shepard, if the mass relays can be destroyed... So did I miss anything? Do you have any questions? You gonna go file your story now? Well, if you don't mind. Go tell the galaxy what we've done. They could use some good news. Aye, aye, Commander.
Lieutenant Commander Williams said something about enjoying some downtime on the Citadel. Might be a nice break for both of you. Commander? You're cleared to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? I'll handle it. Yes, Commander. I've got your briefing, Private. Let's fill you in before the squad arrives. The Alliance is posting us to an eagle mining Urgently, human, I must speak to you on behalf of my people. What is it? Holding sorrow, Takuna, my home world, the Reapers have come. Holding sorrow, our warriors are under siege, but your forces can rescue them. Urgently, please, all the other races have turned us aside. I'll take the Normandy as soon as we have time. Relief. Thank you, Commander. Small hope. Perhaps we can evacuate some of our civilians when your forces arrive. Anxiously, I will remain here for news. Please hurry. Takuna burns. I want all remaining files secured and marked for Tentron clearance only. Commander Shepard. Have you found something? We're continuing our investigation into Counselor Udina's activities. It's still not clear how he managed the coup attempt. However, I need to speak with you on another matter. Matters have taken a serious turn for the Asari Republics. We understand your Crucible is still missing an important component. The Catalyst, I believe you call it. Do you know where it is? Unfortunately, no. But we do have an artifact on our home world, Thessia. Classified at the highest levels. What is it? Suffice it to say, it may help you identify the catalyst. The artifact is in a temple located at these coordinates. A scientific team there will provide assistance. I appreciate the help. It's for both our benefit. The homeworld has never been threatened before. 
Thessia has always been an oasis in a galaxy full of turmoil. The Reapers are about to change that. I'll do what I can. More lives depend on you than any soul should have to bear. You have my prayers. Excuse me, I'm Commander Shepard. If you promise to be careful, I've got something for you. Look at this! All it took was a Cerberus attack on the Citadel to get folks around here to pay attention to the war! How is this any different from normal? Can't you see the desperation? This isn't happy dancing. This is forget my problems dancing. Look at the arms. If a guy waves his arms like that, he's worrying about a lot more than looking stupid on the dance floor. That's surprisingly observant. I've had time to watch a lot of dancing from the sidelines. Speaking of which... Dancing? Watching from the sidelines. What do you think about me and Edie? Why not? Because I could break a bone just from some light over the clothes action? That's always a risk. But then so are the Reapers. Yeah, I wasn't planning on dating Harbinger. You know what I mean. If we all ended up dead this time tomorrow, what would you regret? Getting a shattered pelvis and a broken heart. Such a stupid idea. If you could be out there right now on the dance floor, would you be waving your arms? Yeah. Sounds like you've got bigger things to worry about than looking stupid. Yeah, guess I do. Now, if you'll excuse me... This sucks. What have you got there? Duty roster for the students. It's what I do for fun now. They've got us spread out across Alliance units. Reinforcing barriers, modding ammo, that kind of thing. How are they holding up? They are fine. They're not the ones reading duty rosters while on shore leave. Complain if you like, but I think military life suits you. Hey, running back to the Alliance was your lifelong dream, not mine. Come on, plenty of combat, free room and board, and people you can depend on. Yeah, yeah, maybe your little suicide squad taught me something about teamwork. Speaking of which, thanks. My guys are handling the support stuff well. Still see some action, but they're not on the front lines. They've saved a lot of lives. It'd be a hell of a lot more fun with you. You find bigger fights. But the little shits are useless without me. I gotta stick with them. Cause I'm dependable now, apparently. I blame you for this, Shepard. Come on. What? The duty rosters can wait. Right now, you're on shore leave. Everybody knows you can't dance. 